It's been two days, but the Bernie Sanders memes keep on coming and we like it. Keep them coming. The Vermont Senator went viral for his cozy inauguration attire and people have been photoshopping him into places ever since, including around Pittsburgh, from a chair at the U.S. Capitol to that classic Pittsburgh parking chair to this, the giant sinkhole that swallowed up a Port Authority bus. He's even checking on me while I work out in the field, making sure I'm up to snuff. The world is calling it grumpy chic, and the one item everyone is smitten over is his handmade mittens. Turns out you can get your very own. Rhonda Androla is a retired teacher from Big Beaver who happens to be really good at sewing warm wool mittens, but she doesn't keep all the money for herself. There's an amazing cause behind it all. Excited because she joins us live over Zoom tonight to explain. Rhonda, thank you for joining us tonight. Thank you for having us. It's nice to be here. What, what did you first think when you realized everyone was suddenly smitten with the mittens? Oh, we were excited. I. I had seen Bernie Sanders sitting there, but never noticed the mittens until my daughter sent a picture. And I said, oh boy, we have to jump on this because we've been selling the mittens for about four years and doing well, but they really have uh, in the last couple of days started to go like hot potatoes. Yeah, when you see a mitten opening like this, you gotta, gotta take it. We're so gonna jump on it, yeah. <laughs> so Especially, Oh, what were you I was say? just going to say, especially uh, for the reason that we do it, we we donate the money to Alzheimer's Association in honor of my brother, who suffers with Alzheimer's. So uh, we've done this for about four years, and if we can sell more mittens, then we're going to jump on it. Can you tell us about your mittens, the styles, the colors? How do you make them? Uh, the mittens are made from recycled wool sweaters. We have fun going to the uh, thrift stores or people donate their old sweaters to us. Some people actually have a special sweater. Maybe it was their mother's or grandmother's and we make mittens for them out of those special sweaters. Uh, so anyway, it's from upcycled wool that is felted. That means we wash it several times in hot, hot water. And then we have uh, fleece lining and Ooh. I'll tell people that they're the warmest mittens you ever will wear. And when people buy them, they go, oh, Rhonda, you're right. They are really warm. For a walker or uh, older people, you know, they're easy on and off. They're very they're nice pretty. and cozy. We're seeing all the pretty pictures of them. And they're perfect for this weekend when it's going to be freezing. Yes, yes. Your fingers will not be cold in those <laughs> mittens. So it's a... Uh, it's also a therapy for our family. It's uh, numerous sisters, brothers, in-laws, cousins. We get together once a week and uh, work and then take some work home. And it's a little bit of therapy in um, yeah. dealing with Alzheimer's in the family. And how can people find you and your mittens? We are on Etsy now and it is called Mittens for Memories. That's all one word. And so you would just go uh, to Etsy and look for the Mittens for Memories and you'll look us up. We have our mittens posted on there. And Rhonda, we can mail them to you. Thank you so much for taking the time to speak with us and we hope that Bernie helps you sell all the mittens.